Hi, this is Sherry Veronica, and we are hearing through the chat that Justin Dorsett has died. Don't know what he died of, but it is being suggested that Justin Dorsett is dead. Now, Justin Dorsett came to your news via Naked Departure. If you go to Naked Departure in the video section, or if you search for Justin Dorsett via Naked Departure, you will see that I put up a blog, a warning blog regarding Justin. Now, he lived in Barbados. He has Barbadian parents who were in England. I think he was born in England, but he lived in Barbados for a while, and he was accused he was accused of raping someone in Barbados and while the case was to be heard in the court and he was out on bail, he left Barbados and went to England. So he absconded. He left a place where he should not have left. He should have waited for that trial to be heard. Guilty, not guilty. That should have happened. It never happened. He left and went to England. In England, my video that is up, you, sh you see people have him held down they have their hands on him they have him held down because they claim that he went to a young girl's house she was probably 13 i think and it is alleged that he was at her house you know for what he's a predator it is alleged that justin dorset was a predator now we are hearing that he has died they seem to be a twin out there and the twin is saying that they are numb now was that particular twin numb also when they were hearing that their brother was out there being accused of all these things? We're not saying that he's guilty. Let's say that he has he is as pure as the driven snow and everyone is wrong about him. Okay, let's say that. But let's say that there's truth. Let's say that there is truth in what he has been accused of. Does the twin not feel sorry for his victims does the twin not say in some part of their heart maybe it's best that he left and may he be at peace now with whatever demons that may have been residing in him does that twin not say that and stay off of social media pretending to be all emotional you know sometimes you have that ch you have to check that emotional program that you have installed in you you have to check it and when someone has done things that are contrary contrary to the moral to the moral fiber of what we try we try to have here on the earth you have to watch your emotional response when those particular people are dead because I've even seen I've even seen and heard of people attending funerals of their pedophile fathers fathers who have done the unimaginable and they have attended the funeral and cried and thrown themselves on the ground and being so mournful and and they know they know that is a son of a bitch that's leaving the earth they know but then they will show up and they would perform. They have you you have got to work on those emotional programs that you have installed in you. You have to watch yourself. You have to watch what you're trying to tell the world because the world is not believing you. The world knows that it's a son of a bitch that's leaving the earth. The, the world knows that. So you have to watch your emotional response to things that happen because then they're going to start to look at you. If you are going to throw yourself on the ground or if... You are going to say, oh, I'm numb and I'm so shocked and this and that. They're going to start to look at you because if you resonate with that, <laughs> you can't be so far off the mark either. They have to keep an eye on you. Sherry Veronica.